Okay, the next tool is the lasso tool. If you click that, um, it is like drawing with a pencil. I mean, it's click and drag all the way around whatever it is you want to select. And uh, that can be very tedious for something like the sunflower. But there you go. The next one is called the magnetic lasso tool. And I'm going to deselect and zoom in a little bit so you can see the detail in this. Um, wherever you click um, to start, it is going to just jump to the edge based on the contrast in the picture. Now, sometimes it loses its way because of the contrast. Um, and if that happens, like what's happened just now, you just want to press the backspace. It'll take out any points that were set. Then you can click to set your own points. And there you go. Now once you're um, done setting your own points, you can let it uh, try to grab again. And notice how it missed the tip there. So backspace, backspace, click, click, and click. And then it's doing the magnetic thing again. So anyway, I'm not going to finish this selection all the way around the sunflower. I'm just going to make this little sliver here. And control D to deselect. Then the next one is the polygonal lasso tool. And click and then let go of the mouse. It does straight lines. So you would have to click a lot to go around the edge of something like this sunflower here. And it gives you no curves whatsoever. It does not jump to the edges. I hope that was helpful. Stay tuned for more tools.